What is up, YouTube? I am here with my dude, Jared. Say what's up. Yo, what up? And what we're doing today, we're gonna go review a burger joint called Tasty Made. Now, what makes Tasty Made special is that it's made by Chipotle. So the same people that give us those awesome bowls and burritos and guacamole and cheese and all that stuff, my personal favorite fast food place to go to eat healthy, they decided to do their own spin on a burger joint. Very similar to Five Guys Burgers and Fries. Very minimalist menu. You can literally, I think, only get cheeseburgers, fries, and drinks, and shakes. I think is all you're able to get. Simple so, menu. Simple menu. And they're using quality ingredients like they say they do at Chipotle. The first one ever, for some reason, I do not know why they chose Lancaster, Ohio to place their location, but the first one ever is here in my city. And it opened up about what, would you say, three weeks ago? Like about 20 days. Okay, about 20 days ago. And a lot of people that reviewed it initially didn't really have good things to say about it. They were mixed reviews. I think anytime you have like a new restaurant, that's going to happen. So we've given it about 20 days. They should have it for the most part figured out now. We are on our way there right now. It is 10.30 a.m. They open at 10. 10.17. Oh, 10.17, there we go. So we're gonna head there. We're gonna try to hit it hard. We're gonna do a review. We're gonna do a taste test. And I don't think we're each gonna eat a full meal. It's still too early. I don't feel like shoving myself with burgers and fries yet, but we're gonna get a burger, gonna get some fries. We're gonna do a strict taste test. We're gonna review the facility. It's gonna be fun. Review so. the facility. <laughs> <laughs> so hopefully you guys are ready. We're gonna get this done and you will know <laughs> if it lives up to the Chipotle hype or not. So stay tuned. All right. <laughs> <laughs> they do. So, up oh, we are pulling in now. There. And here we are at Tasty Made. This is a pretty cool looking restaurant, really. I really like the freshly paved cement here, so <laughs> the walk up is good so far. Yeah, cool little sign, check that out. Handicap friendly. Handicap friendly. They're doing a lot of things right already. Yeah. It's like a futuristic type of... And look at the outside seating, you know? It's really McDonald's style. McDonald's style, I think they're going with like a classic look here. It's a little cold for that right now, though. <laughs> it is, we're gonna, we're gonna go inside. Why don't you go first? All right, what we got here? Pretty good, how are you? I have not eaten here yet, hold up. Look at that menu. Wow, we can read that really easy. You don't have to have any education to read that menu. That is literally the menu right there, guys. Wow. Tasty that's... made hamburger. Very simple. What do you want to order, man? I'm not sure. See, I'm not a, like a really big burger and fries guy. Me neither. But but we want to. What what, what does everybody order usually? Um, most people order the Tasty Made, which is our signature burger. The Tasty Made. The Tasty Made. The Tasty Made. All right. Well, why don't we just try the signature burger? This is actually a review video. Yeah, we're do, we're doing a review. All right, guys. After looking at the menu, I think we're just gonna do a Tasty Made and some fries. So uh, let's see. <laughs> not okay. We better get a double. I can eat a double. You can eat a double. You can eat a double. If she can eat a double, then we can. If eat a she double. can eat a double, we can eat a double. All right. You uh, can solo a double. <laughs> she can solo a double. We can tag team a double. Yeah. <laughs> Let's do a, give me a double tasty made, okay. but um, all we want on it is cheese and the sauce. And then we're gonna do some uh, fries too. And then I think that's really all. A shake on us. A shake. A shake on us? A shake on you. Okay, fine, a shake on you. How about strawberry? A free shake? <laughs> is that what just happened to Tasty Made? It is. Oh my goodness. They care about their customers. That is generosity in extreme. We're paying for the order right now. Eight, seven, eight. Okay, so we got we got a double tasty made burger, fries, and they gave us a free shake. Eight seventy five for total. So pricing doesn't seem too bad. Not bad. We got the post office guy right here with mail. Bye. Bye. All right, guys. So we are seated here. This is similar to Five Guys in that you place your order, they make it fresh for you, and you wait on it, and they let you know when it's ready. So we're chilling. We'll order number sixteen. We're waiting for the call. How you feeling about it? I'm really good. It feels really good in here. It does, man. I like it. The The lady was nice. I don't know if she knew we were doing a review and gave us a free shake or not, but uh, I can't complain about a free shake. We will be back as soon as our order is here, and we'll give you guys a taste review, all right? Uh, <laughs> all right, the strawberry shake is done now. It's here. Let's move this camera back. This was complimentary. Strawberry shake. Definitely won't have this, though, because I bet you this is full of sugar, so. Oh, you know. We're just going to try it. <laughs> all right, guys. Taste test. Strawberry shake. Hold up. I haven't even looked at it. Oh, I mean, shaky. What do you say? That's really good. On a scale of one to 10, we're gonna give this shake an 8.5. Right, Jared's gonna give it a shot here. Honest review. <laughs> Honest. <laughs> Honest review. Man, that's a good shake. Isn't that a good it's shake? It's really hard to mess up a shake, too. How can you mess up any of this? Okay, here. So, 
That is good, guys. It is really good. Shake 8.5. Okay, and, and I think we should leave it because, you know. Yeah, we're done with that. We don't need a whole lot of it. We don't need that, okay. She delivered us our food, right? So we have, there we go, now it's focused. They look very cooked and just lightly salted, like they're not just doused in salt. Exactly. So we got that, and then our burger. Now, the only the only complaint I'm gonna have right now about the burger is it feels small for a double. You feel that? <laughs> Right? It, so it feels like I have a really nice piece in my hand though. Like hand it off. Ooh, smooth handoff transition. <laughs> so a, a, a 10 out of 10 on handoff transition. For $8.75, this really isn't a ton of food. Chipotle probably would have got me a little better, but who knows? This could be incredible. Let's unwrap this. Oh, oh, get that cheese in there. That is a really nice looking hamburger so far. It is, but it's, it's, melted. it's really small though. Moment of truth, guys. We ready? Take a moderate bite. Yeah, there you go. Be honest. Don't don't go too soon. Be I mean, honest. I mean, let me do one more. Oh man, savor that. You need to give an honest review. This is just brutal honesty here. Before I answer, you're gonna eat it, and then we're both gonna come out and we're gonna okay. talk about it. All right, so you go. I'm hitting that double yeah. cheese side. There's a lot of cheese hanging <laughs> off of it. It's like the corner of the cake with the most icing. <laughs> Tell me when you got your opinions gathered and we'll review the burger. Okay, I'm ready. So, my personal opinion on it. I thought it tasted good. I did enjoy it. A little small for my taste though. As far as the burger goes, I like a bigger burger than that, especially when you're paying that type of money for it. The sauce was pretty good. Bacon sauce, what they call it. I guess it gave it a little bit of a bacon flavor. For a second, I almost thought there was bacon on it. Not exceptional though. It wasn't like, it didn't just jump out at me as this crazy good burger. I think Five Guys probably tastes a little better. This restaurant is still brand new, so it's hard to say. Quality could jump up a little bit. Chipotle can make some big changes. This is their first one, so it's like a test market. It's hard to say, like, but this probably isn't indicative of what the end product's to be. This is their first one ever, so. Um, was it good? Yes. Would I eat it again? Yes, but if I had to choose between this and Five Guys, would I? Mm, that's the question. For burgers, I don't think I would. Personally, for about the same price, and I, you get more of Five Guys, I feel. So, what are your thoughts? He is absolutely right that it's not, it's not an exponentially great hamburger. It is good. It is good. Yeah, right? It is very edible. It, is, it has a lot of taste and it bursts in your mouth like a hamburger should. The cheese is nice. I love the cheese. I, yeah, think, cheese. I think the cheese is one of the, one of the greater Parts it of is. That. It is. It's really good cheese, and you're right about. You said there's bacon sauce on yeah, the burger. Yeah, bacon sauce. So is that the tasty made sauce? Yeah, tasty made sauce. It's bacon flavored sauce. It's bacon sauce. flavored sauce. Okay, well he's right, he's right about most of what he said. I think that the, the burger gets about an eight. It is a very good burger. Just nothing like wow about it. Nothing wow. Exactly. It doesn't have that wow fact. You put that perfectly. Okay. Fry time. So we're gonna do the same thing as before. I'm gonna do it, then you're gonna do it, and we're gonna give you an honest opinion. Okay, go ahead. Do we need ketchup or do we just do just no, the fry? Raw, okay. raw. I'm not a big fan of fries, so I'm just I just not a big guy. Not a big fry guy. Fry guy. He's just a fry guy. Tell me when your thoughts are gathered. That's an authentic fry. That's a really good fry. Okay, so he was right. They taste very authentic. Like it seems like it's just a potato that they fried up. There's not a lot of salt on there. It seems like a real fry. It's not just some like. And they're not too greasy. Exactly. I, I like the fry. I feel like if you sat it on your shelf, it would actually decompose. <laughs> you know what I mean? It seems legit. And like they just made it. It tastes really good, actually. Yeah, I do like the fry. It's mm. it's a will do again. And they're a quick chewer. You just want to. Mm. Right. Right. You can even bunny rat them. Oh no! <laughs> you know what I mean? They're perfect for that. Perfect for that. And I like how some of them are really, really cooked. Like, look at the color on that fry. Ooh, it's a magenta. <laughs> <laughs> Those are so good. They are really good, but I've had enough. Honest opinions on this. I would rate the restaurant probably right now. Uh, what do you think? I'm gonna say a B plus. I'm going straight B. Straight B? Okay. My reasonings behind the B plus are gonna be that, for one, all the ingredients are sourced intelligently, good quality, everything tastes good for the most part, but it doesn't have that wow factor that I, that I think you want. The restaurant's still new, like I touched on before. There's still room for growth, room for improvement. No one's ever good at anything when they first start it. You learn through trial and error, you learn through your experiences, you learn through your mistakes, but I think it's a good start. The customer service gets an A. Customer service does get it an A. It was fantastic. Everybody, everyone here is a happy person. Everybody was friendly, everybody was good, so can't argue that. So yeah, B plus. If you're on the fence about trying it and you live locally, I know a lot of you guys don't, but if you live around me, I think it's worth a try. Now, 875, that's a little 
steep, and that's not and that's not including the shake we got for free. The shake was free. So for this double burger, which is probably the size of like a regular burger, really, with the patties are super thin, and the fries, yeah, a little expensive for my taste. I would not eat here only on very special occasions given the price. And I'm the type of guy too. You may not be like me, but I like to get a lot of protein. So they should have really doubled the meat up, in my opinion. <laughs> um, I think the fry quantity is good. You're not overdosing on carbs here, but uh, I could have used more protein. So do you want to give your rundown real quick? Pretty much just pretty much the same thing that you said. I, I'm really hyped on the customer service. That is everything to the meal. That's everything. The price, yeah, the price, and the size of the burger, yeah. But man, we were treated good. At we were we were treated good. At we here. were. These people are very cool. They didn't have a problem with the review. They didn't have a problem with the camera. Yeah. And they were actually even willing to be in, you know, be filmed. And not everybody's cool about being in a <laughs> being filmed. A lot of people don't like that. And so far, it's just been a good experience. It is a solid B overall. I like it. All right. And so that means that that's a good rating really it's a good rating that is that much of the burger left we got about that much of the fries left we're probably gonna call our quits on everything we have just simply because I don't want to be super full for the rest of the day but this was good so B plus B so and, we, and B. we've kept it light and we've kept it we've light kept it light <laughs> all right <laughs> we are doing a bathroom review in here what, what do you think so far, Jared? Well, your... the water gets warm very quick. That's that's key. If I have to wait 45 seconds to get some warm water so I can wash the salt off my hands, the burger joint's just got a ruined reputation. <laughs> <laughs> and a bathroom is not complete unless you got a paper towel, so... I'm behind you, behind you. Oh my god! Okay, <laughs> that is everything to a bathroom. I do not want blow dried on my hands. <laughs> I want a paper towel. Because if I have a paper towel... <laughs> that, was, that, was, that was like quality on them. <laughs> They're falling apart a little bit, but that is good. I like the paper towel. You can blow your nose. <laughs> the mirror is nice and clean. The soap is high quality. And you know they've got two soaps. They've got a soap to the left, a soap to the right. What kind of soap guy are you? Left or right? You know, both hands. Do whatever you want. Dude, and don't even got directions if you haven't washed your hands in a long time. Holy crap, dude. Yeah, because it's been three months for me. If it's been that long, you need to read the directions. First, you put your hat in your apron. Put on hat and apron. <laughs> <laughs> we're, we're doing this wrong. <laughs> I forgot to put the apron on. <laughs> and then and then you scrub your forearms. Do you actually <laughs> scrub your... Do you come up in here at the restaurant? <laughs> I keep it down below. Me too. Really, you know, I keep it down here. Oh. And then they tell you to use the paper towel. So, very good directions here. Overall, it's great. Is that a baby station? Is this a baby station? Is, is this child friendly? I think so. Oh, oh my gosh. There we go. If dude. you have an infant, tasty made restroom facilities. <laughs> Look at that. You can just put the thing Dude, in. dude, or if you were like socially awkward, you could come in here and just eat. <laughs> you put it right here. <laughs> <laughs> and then just like, you know, You're done with it. You don't have to like clean it off. Or you can leave your trash in there and just flip it up for the next guy. Yeah. And now I don't know what's in here. I'm sure that's the electrical box to make sure everything is flushing okay. This is a great bathroom. It is. I really and, and you know, this is a big thing too. If I don't have anything to hold on to when I'm on the toilet, I don't like that. I like and that's really sturdy too. So. That is that, that is sturdy and plus too like if it's leg day. Why would that help on leg day? Dude. Have you ever sat down after legs? Oh, so you- On the commode? So you can like slowly come down. Yes, yes. Oh, you can even actually- Exactly, can anchor actually, with it. You can get some squat work going in here if you need to. Dude, this is just an overall great facility. <laughs> and if, if you were to- Dude, high five, man. I'm really liking it in here. <laughs> So that was our review of Tasty Made. Hopefully you had fun. Like we said, customer service is great. Look at her smile. Look at Always. her smile. There's one back there too. Is there a smile back there? Oh, smile back there. Smile. Say hi guys. Always smiling. <laughs> so yeah, it's been a really cool experience. Hopefully you enjoyed the review. Yes. If you want more reviews like this, comment below. We don't always review restaurants, but hey, it, it's content. <laughs> We're having fun, right? So thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, all that good stuff, guys. We appreciate you. And yeah, if you're in the area, try out Tasty Made. All right, have a good one, guys.